if you are being told over and over and over again, you are overqualified, then the problem, and this is hard to hear, the problem is in your delivery. So you are coming across like the Jack or Jill of all trades. You are giving the persona of, I'm a, I think I'm a BMW for the price of a Honda and nobody buys that. So when you're being told you're overqualified folks, that is like a nice excuse for saying you would be too difficult to work with. And people get so defensive when I say this, but hear me out. They're looking at your level of experience and they're saying you'd be bored here, right? Because they don't want you to come in and act like a know-it-all. Again, that has a lot to do with the way your resume is designed. I see a lot of people whose resumes are way overdone and the immediate impression is you're overqualified. You gotta scale that puppy back. This is all in the way you deliver your experience. This is what I mean. Your tools, your brand, how you're delivering this is impacting how you're being perceived. You might say that's not fair. I'm not overqualified, I'm qualified. But in this world, too many employers have hired somebody who's more senior only to have them walk out the door. So they are right in their concern. You have to fix your branding. When you fix your branding, you won't come across as overqualified. And trust me, you can come at me with this, but I have worked with so many people inside Work It Daily who come in with, I'm getting discriminated against for my age. I'm getting told I'm overqualified. And when I tell them they have a branding issue, they get kind of huffy. And then they get in and they start going through the tools and they particularly go through my interview prep over 40, which talks about this and they get it. They're like, oh my gosh, I get it now. Like I'm the brand and my brand is landing wrong. And when you change how your brand lands, you get the opportunities. Do you feel better as you sit and listen to more information about job search? Be honest, are you feeling better? Like, are you feeling a little bit more clarity? Okay, like you're starting to understand things a bit more, right? This is why job search career coaching is vitally important. Because if you are feeling better after sitting on a single live with me, can you imagine if you had access to my proprietary course where I teach you step by step by step what to do, and you had access to the coaches who could confirm that you've done everything right, think about how you would feel. Think about that. That's why this exists. My job is to alleviate your pain. My job is to remove the roadblocks. My job is to solve the problems, okay? You do not need to be doing this alone. You shouldn't be. And if you're having any sort of feeling of feeling better listening to this, then can just imagine how it would feel if you were in a program that could solve for all of this right? I challenge you on that.